<laughs> hey guys, it's for Botting is Sexy. Uh, we're gonna do some blue nose luck. <laughs> I don't know what the controls are. Um, what is A? Okay. Yeah, we all know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's the, what are the controls here? Okay, that's A. Um, uh, I just have a loss for words with the the feelings I have while watching that intro. I just yeah. It just makes me smile so much. And we're gonna name our our rival Agro, because he is my rival in real life. I will kill him someday. No, I won't. <laughs> anyway, I thought it would be uh, kind of ironic, kind of fun, to start playing blue version as X and Y is coming out, because X and Y comes out like a couple weeks I mean if I depending on what time I upload this it should be you know just a couple weeks so it's like the perfect time to play blue version <laughs> uh, it's really funny uh, looking at the art uh, watching the intro again like the sprite work for this game looks intentionally retro but I think that's because Red and Blue inspired so many uh, young artists that went on to make sprite work. It's really weird. It's like got a 360 effect, if you know what I'm talking about. Robo's playing the SNES! Okay! Uh, this makes me think of my orthodontist. Um, way back in St. Louis. I went to an orthodontist and had braces, got my teeth fixed up, and he had a basket um, in his waiting office. He had a basket of Game Boys, and all the cartridges were like taped in, but like he had four of them that just had Pokemon, because he knew he knew that Pokemon was a thing, <sighs> and he would have freshly baked uh, like. Uh, Pillsbury Doughboy chocolate chip cookies or something, which I always thought was kind of weird since you have to brush your teeth <laughs> to go over there, but I guess like when you're done you can have some cookies. Uh, I was looking for you. So this is a Nuzlocke, in case you were born yesterday or you are have a very sheltered Pokemon life, uh, I'll tell you what it is. Um, you can only catch one Pokemon per route. And if that Pokemon dies, you have to box it or release it. You must nickname your Pokemon. Uh, I play by a rule where you have to kill all legendaries because I just think it's more fun that way. And some of the legendaries are actually hard. Like in my um, in my uh, randomizer emerald, the, I like ran into a bunch a bunch of Kyogres that almost killed me. <laughs> so yeah, that rule can be fun. Gramps isn't around. He's not oh, I forgot. Yeah, I have to walk into the grass. Oh man, I play, I play this game so much. It's one of those games where I would just play it, beat it, and then reset it immediately, and then just play it again. And I just had it, had it memorized. And like, whenever I was sick as a kid, I would just play the game over and over, and just start over and see how far I could get in a day. Like I would speed run this as a kid. <laughs> Uh, so many uh, runs with like, I don't know, like, I would have Nidoqueen or Nidoking just really early on because you can get Moonstones really early. I'll probably do that if I get it, run, run into a Nidoran. That'd be really good. So that with waiting. Hey girl, let me think. Oh, so I'm gonna pick Bulbasaur because I've always been a Bulbasaur man, and the story behind that is my brother told me to choose, my older brother told me to choose Bulbasaur because he said there were like parts of the game where you 
had to use Vine Whip to, like, cross giant chasms or something. And I believed him, because I believe everything everybody says, and I'm really gullible, so... It's been Bulbasaur ever since. Hey, Gramps, what about me? See, what would- what starter would- does Agru really prefer? It's probably not Bulbasaur. I wonder if he's a Charmander guy. There are a lot of people who just really diss on Charizard lately, I don't really get it. Like, sure, he's overrated, but in Never Used, he's extremely powerful. Strange to see those. His birth. Ba 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 ba. Yeah. But one is really energetic. Got Bulbasaur! Yes. I've always named Bulbasaur Bulby. I just always have. Oops. No. Yeah. So I'm ex in, along with just wanting to play this before X and Y comes out, and just the funny fact that I'm playing the first one and X and Y is coming out. I was been inspired by Foxfire, who's another Poketuber. I'll leave her link, her channel link in the description. She's currently playing through Red Version, but she's really busy at college, so she hasn't really gotten that far, but, like, I don't know, like, her episodes, they just eat it up. Like, I'm like, mmm, good, make more, but she's, like, really busy. And also, of course, Ninja Death Strike uh, has pretty much inspired me to no end. It's really weird. He's, like, the first guy, first Poke, or uh, first YouTuber period who I got to know. Um, yeah. Who became friends with. And yeah, good stuff. Um, yeah, hopefully Agro doesn't just destroy me on the first battle, because this is a Nuzlocke, and I don't know. <laughs> Oh look, they're like colored. I'm not sure if this ROM like colors them. Like purposefully colors them. Cause I get this ROM for my brother because you know he's a he's a Yaha fiddle DD and he's got all this stuff. Um yeah, that's cool. One um, mm, This is not looking good. Ah, uh, critical hit, that's what you get. That was close. That was close. He's growl two or three times, I think just twice, but like Yeah, getting that crit <laughs> that crit mattered. <laughs> oh that crit mattered. Sixty-nine experience points! What is with sixty-nine? In Pokemon. I don't get it. Oh also, what inspired me, and this is an odd segue. <laughs> the number 69 in Pokemon. Xenon, um, yeah, he's gotta be my favorite, uh, famous Poketuber. I just love his stuff. He's been playing a, uh, a, a, a ROM hack of Blue Version called Blue Kaizo. I think he's currently on, like, the 30-some-odd episode right now, and it's just insane, like, the trials and tribulations that he must go through, because, like, yeah, like, it's such a hard game. Like, you just have to grind for hours, otherwise you don't stand a chance. It's And it's so fun to watch. And of course, this isn't going to be anything like that, because this is just pl plain old blue version. But yeah. What? Unbelievable! I picked the wrong Pokemon. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon fight to toughen it up. Gramp, smell you later. <laughs> Why would you want to smell your grandfather? <laughs> yeah. So this will be fun. I'm really glad I didn't lose. I, th I think I would have just continued because I don't really care. Now I can get the map from my sister, which is actually kind of important in a Nuzlocke. Oh, that's my house. Weird, I thought... 
Oh, I think they uh, switch houses in Fire Red and Leaf Green. I believe in Fire Red and Leaf Green, your house is on the right and Gary's house is on the left. I could be wrong. Oh, I guess I can't get her map yet. Do I have to talk to Oak? Oh my gosh, this is like the first time I'm playing it. It's like I just don't know what to do. Here's your young Pokemon for making it fight. What the hell? Do I have to... <laughs> Do I have to just figure out the parcel on my own? Mm. Ooh, color change. So this, uh, these encounters won't mm, count because I don't have a Pokeball yet. And strangely, they aren't happening. <laughs> Weird. The luckiest man in the world over here. Oh, let's. Okay, that's my start. Bulby, let's take a look at you. Ah, uh, good stuff. I just tried to cycle through his stats by, you know, using the left and right thing. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, Oak's parcel. Done. So I don't know how long these parts are going to be, um, I don't know, like the last couple times I've done any kind of Pokemon Let's Play, they've been like hour long, <laughs> so... <laughs> yeah, I don't know, maybe I'll do 30 minutes. Oh, well, Bulby's too powerful. But I actually do have a fat nickname list, which I need to mention, um, I... Before recording my first episode, I asked a bunch of people if they wanted to be on the nickname list. Uh, and then, even before that, I added a bunch of people. Um, so, the list is pretty much full. But if you really, 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 really want to be on my nickname list, and you want to be something I catch, then leave a comment. But it's, like, almost full. Like, I'll, uh... Here, I'll just... There. <laughs> there are only 35... I mean, how many roots... Roots? How many roots are in blue version anyway? I've got 20 nicknames already, so I'm pretty good. <laughs> the speed of button is so weird. Do, 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 ratata. The speed of button is like faster in this game or something. I don't know. Whatever. Let's get it going. A little bittersweet, cause like I had a leaf green uh, let's play and I got really really far and then my computer died. <laughs> and I didn't back up the save on like a USB or anything, so I just lost all of it. In case you're wondering when I'm going to upload the next part of my <laughs> Leaf Green, which I uploaded like two years ago. So, probably not going to happen. I did finish off my White 2, though. It was one of my goals to finish White 2, uh, the main, s or the Nuzlocke challenge anyway, to finish that before X and Y come, came out. Came out. Right. Yeah, so I did that, and now I'm gonna play blue. Here's your shit, Oak, you piece of crap. It seems to like you a lot. What? You have something for me? I'm honored, thank you. Okay. Alright, Gramps, leave it all to me. Oh, I hate to say it, but you don't. I don't need you, I know. Borrow the time map. Okay, now I can get the time map. <laughs> Whatever, man. I'm gonna get it from your sister, and it's gonna be great. And that's not. That's not a sex innuendo. Although, for a um, Game Boy sprite, she's pretty cute. Town map, town map. Do, 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 I, do I have Pokeballs now? No. 
Do I need to talk to someone in there to get Pokeballs? Pretty sure one of them gives me Pokeballs. Uh. <laughs> okay! They don't. <laughs> Fun. Oh shit, <laughs> nightmares. Yeah, I guess you have to buy Pokeballs then. Oh, maybe I'm just thinking of just like 3rd gen where they give you Pokeballs. I believe they do that. Yeah, I guess the uh, first couple gens, they don't give you anything when you start. KG, I don't have a Pokeball yet, but you would make a fine Pokemon. In fact, you'd make a super fine Pokemon. Get that hyper beam. Get that fly. Good stuff. Come on. Get out of here. Get out of here. You give me a potion, yes? No? Thanks. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Where's the potion kid? I must have passed him. Oh well. I'll find him later. Good stuff, good stuff. If you're enjoying this so far, good job. I don't know, Pokemon LPs seem really, really dull, just as a whole. I feel like that's why Nuzlocks are so popular. <laughs> oh shit! That guy needs to calm the fuck down. Um, yeah, because it's like, I don't know. If you've played Pokemon, you know it's coming. It's the same old grind. Get some Pokeballs. Eight. Do I have enough money for that? I guess I do. Thank you. Oh <laughs> shit, nightmares. <laughs> the nightmare button. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll go for 30 minutes, I don't know. Whatever. YOLO. YOLO Tony, Brown Town. Check yourself right out the door. You know, like, if this is too long for you, you can, like, pause, or, you know, you could, like, close the tab and then watch the rest of it later. I feel- that's like what I do with Xenon's videos, because he's uploading hour-long videos now, which I think that's a little- a little excessive. But yeah, actually I can't really judge, because I've just uploaded two hour-long LPs, being the last two parts of my, um, Y2. Okay. Don't crit it. Oh wow. I did like nothing. I'm gonna growl you and leech seed you. Probably a terrible idea. So, first nickname on the list is Shark. Oh, I sing a little song. Shark gets to be a rat attack. Normally I would break my own rule and just name it Mr. Born Smooth, but. I feel like I'm, I'm gonna stick to the list this time. But Mr. Born Smooth is on there. Actually, his name is Mr. Smooth, because that is a perfect 10 character limit. <laughs> Mr. Smooth. Yeah! Caught a Radita! Perfect first Pokemon. And to be honest, so many routes just repeat Radita and Pidgey that I'm just gonna get a Pidgey anyway, so it's really doesn't matter. Oh, I forgot that was one of the rules uh, for Nuzlocke's uh, no repeats, so like if you see a Pokemon that you already have, you can, you will get another chance to catch a new one, if you didn't know that. Bites anything when it attacks, small and very quick. It is a common sight in many places. Yeah, baby. Shark. He bites hard like a shark. Shark. Okay. I'm gonna grind up shark off screen. And then I'll catch another Pokemon. Because there's another route. Away, aways to the left, whatever route that is. Hopefully, I'll get a Neater in there. I believe it's Neater and Pidgey. Since it says blue version, I will get a Neater and female, which is fine. 
So I'm gonna pause and grind, so yeah. Hang in there. Okay, for our purposes, I'd say we are done grinding. I got Bulby to level nine. Amazingly, he does not know Vine Whip yet. I guess he gets it a bit later. Uh, Shark is level seven. He got Quick Attack, which is basically Haymaker in this game. And yeah, pretty much. Uh, I guess I'll go catch whatever's in that grass. I'm gonna see if it is a new area. Wait, how do I use this? Ah, uh, Route 22. Okay, yeah. Alright, let's catch a new Pokemon. Pokemon. This Dream Eater guy. Which I, if I ever get a uh, Drowsy, which I probably will. So let's face it. In the blue version. Um, I will very, very enjoy Dream Eatering stuff. Okay. These guys seem to have weaker Pokemon. Hey, whoa! Neater and male! I believe that is a rare encounter for, uh... For this game. Let me see my stats. Because this is blue version. Its attack is slightly lower. Does stab exist in this game? <laughs> I don't know, I'm gonna tackle. Yeah, okay. I did decent damage. Yeah, this is great. Uh, cause Nido King is extremely good. Just in general. Unfortunately, that means I will have to grind another Pokemon. Ah, <laughs> uh, what are you gonna do? There you go, Nidoran with Mail was caught. I'm teaching Blizzard and... Horn Drill. I, re oh, I remember my friend Andrew Wheatley, when we were kids, we would, um... Link Cable battle, because I actually had a Link Cable. And his Horn Drill would always hit, and I would never know why. But I think... The one hit KO moves are based on accuracy, or s or not accuracy, but speed. I'm not really sure. Neuter and male, poison pin. Stiffens its ears to sense danger. The larger its horns, the more powerful its secreted venom. Wow. And this guy is Mike. And not the Mike Mike. The other Mike. That is to say, the uh, dominant mic from that Skype group, The Gathering. <laughs> uh, fun times. Mike, you are Nidoran. Oh, Billy Bob Thornton. Uh, I feel like this is a good, good place to end it. Um, I'll grind off screen a little bit and then yeah part two will happen anyway this has been my um, blue nuzlocke part one comment like subscribe if you enjoyed it and all that shit and i'll see you later youtube